her she blows <laughs> who is she <laughs> who is she <laughs> who stop who huh? <laughs> uh oh movement body hello what's up my babies welcome back to another video my name is Kay, and this is crown baller first things first before we even get into the video hit that red subscribe button down below join the team consider our bench we would love to have you here also follow me on all of my social medias they will be on the screen and if not they will be in the description box Hello. so without further ado let's get into this video hold my camera right now because i'm about to go do my face i know i'm looking real crackheadish yes people do love me jesus especially i kind of have been cleaning all morning it's saturday saturdays are for cleaning but we have a team photo shoot today i'm gonna get ready with you guys but i'm not gonna really do my makeup i'm gonna actually do my makeup off camera really quick and then i'm gonna come back so give me a second real quick just hold up we back ooh ooh she be ooh ooh we back she be we back she be she be she be hey i think that's gonna be my new theme song so she's beat we're back and we're better <laughs> praise god we're gonna take this struggle bun down all right and y'all normally i would have my hair like braided underneath my wigs but i don't plan on having this wig on longer than like a day i'm gonna show y'all like my quick version of what i do with my hair i'm gonna do a side part tenderheadedness do it like this here do y'all see that highlight oh hey i'm just gonna spray this this is just water and a little bit of leave-in conditioner and i'm literally just spraying the outside i'm just brushing this into a low pony kind of action here Whew. my arms hurt already this is what I have right here. I literally just slicked it back into a little braid and I'm gonna do the exact same thing onto the other side. Arms are all burnt, praise God. And then we have our two little piggy tails and like cross them. And then I just use a freaking, what is this thing called? Wig cap. And that's how I do the non-braided version underneath my wigs. And don't make fun of my wig cap. I reuse my wig caps, period. Like I'm not doing that ball cap method where I'm cutting my wig cap every time I put a wig on. That's all the way dead. This is hair from Wiggins Hair Company on AliExpress. It is made into a closure lace wig. It's a four by four closure. And I did sew a strap in the inside of this joint. So I'm gonna put her on. The struggle is real. <sighs> I feel like my head is getting bigger by the day. Oh, goodness. We're going to put her over on to the side. Ooh, might have made this strap a little too tight. And you know what's crazy? I got to ref a little kid's tournament. I have to ref before the photo shoot. So all of this stuff that I'm doing right now is really honestly a waste of my time because my hair is going to get sweated out. My makeup is going to get sweated out. And so like... This is gonna be like, uh, pointless. We gonna do it anyway, y'all. We gonna do it anyway. I'm just gonna kinda readjust this part. Make it into like a C curve-ish joint, something. I am gonna do a review on this hair. I think I'm gonna do a review like, I guess I could do it while, <laughs> while we're here. Before I like define all this good stuff, I'm gonna just gonna secure it down. So I like to use bobby pins when I am not like gluing my, my closure down. But I don't like to use them all the time though because bobby pins along with like uh, the clips that go that people put in their wigs and stuff, like I feel like they be like ripping out your edges. I'm like, <laughs> I don't wanna be edgeless. We can't really see my part. It's looking real wiggish right now. I'm gonna like flatten this out so you can see my part. So I'm just gonna use my blow dryer and I'm gonna put it on the highest heat setting. And we're gonna fan it out just like this. So this is my little technique when I don't have a hot comb. I'm not liking the way that this is looking though. What do I need to do? All right, we're just gonna put a little bit of free spray cause this lace ain't acting correct. And it's like pulling back and I don't want it to be like wiggy. So I'm gonna spray just a little bit along. First of all, I'm getting low. I have been searching high and low all over Sweden for some freaking got to be glue free spray and I have not found any. I found a hair store, the beauty store, the 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 regular grocery store, nobody. I'm going crazy. I'm almost out. 
I'm going to just have to order something off Amazon and just pay that shipping fee. I don't want to, but I'm going to have to. <sighs> okay, I feel a little bit more secure now. This is, I believe it's an 18, 20, and 22 of Brazilian Body Wave. All this stuff will be in the description box below. I'll make sure I have all the links and all of that good stuff down there because I really don't know. I believe this is like a 14 or a 16 inch lace closure. I'm trying to debate whether or not I really want to keep it wavy. I really like the wavy look because I love the body. But I kind of want to go for a sleek chic look. However, I'm running short on time, so I'm in a bit of a pickle. I already got my flat irons hot because I didn't know if I wanted to or not. So I'm just going to put a little bit of argon oil on my hair. This hair does get a little bit dry, y'all. Like, I won't lie. I love the hair and all, but they be getting dry. And I'd be like, why? Like, why are you getting dry? We're going to do a rush job. <laughs> I'm going to see how long it takes me to flat iron this hair i'm supposed to be at this gym at like around like 2 15 it's already 1 15 and it takes like at least 20 minutes to get to the gym so i gotta leave sooner than later i'm really happy i can come on here and talk to you like this like i appreciate y'all for letting me but let me tell you a little bit more about this hair right since i mean since we're here i might as well just <laughs> tell you about it i did not purchase this hair a friend of mine bought this hair and she wanted to wear it for graduation which she did however whoever made her wig literally ruined the integrity of the hair if i can if that's the word i should use like i don't know if that's the word and when my friend sent me this hair i was like well why don't you like it it's so beautiful when she first sent it to me it was so beautiful it came in that little um you know like the little satin bags that everybody is sending out now and she literally wore the wig for about a week and she didn't want anything else to do with the hair and it was literally because of the way the girl made the wig like one I don't know if my head is just big, but this wig is so snug on my head. I don't know if she made the wig on a customized foam head or mannequin head or whatever, but this joint is snug. That's one. Two, the closure was a free part closure. And when I got the hair, I'm like, oh, you must have ordered a middle part closure because the way that this closure is plucked, it looks like, like why would anybody send a closure out like this? Like I was upset that they sent um the closure out like that and I'm, she was like no it was a free part closure um that's how the girl plucked it she plucked it into a middle part and i was like why would she do that she literally ruined the wig i wish i could show y'all let me see if i can show y'all this is a is a middle part wig nope nope i want to show y'all so bad oh let me find it jesus let me find it baby girl plucked the life out of it oh i can't find it i don't know where it is if i find it i'm gonna put a picture or something like it's so thick there's nothing natural about the middle part that she plucked so that's why my friend was like nah i'm not really feeling this wig maybe you can do something with it because i don't like it at all and of course she sent it to me and i finessed it i mean <laughs> come on that's what it looks like straight on one side and now i have this whole side to go but on to the actual problems that the company has given us that's the more important thing i'm gonna be real with y'all no matter if the video is sponsored no matter if i bought the hair no matter if if i found it on the street i'm gonna give y'all the honest opinion like i told y'all this hair gets very dry and not only does it get dry but this hair and i'm not sure if it was because of the way the girl made the wig or if it's just how the hair is but when i say that this hair sheds this hair sheds like the amount of shedding that i receive just brushing my hair or even just running my fingers through the hair like it's it's honestly <laughs> it's not okay there hasn't been one instance where i've ran my my fingers through the hair and i haven't got any shedding like i literally just got four strands doing that i'm gonna give it the benefit of the doubt like i don't really know if it's because of the hair or if it's because of the way the girl made the wig i know a lot of people like to cut their webs when they make wigs and sometimes when you cut your webs it does leave the hair you know vulnerable to shedding i don't know if you know baby girl made another mistake with the wig and did that or if it's just wiggins hair i'm not sure which one to blame but i do know 
that baby be shedding. As far as tangles, I get some snags here and there, but the hair doesn't tangle. Like the nape of the neck is not really like tangled. I've had a few, you know, some companies where the hair is just beautiful and the nape of the neck is just like nest like i can say that that's not the case for this wig and i have played in this wig i've worked out in this wig like it i've done a lot of things actively with this wig and i haven't had that issue i'm really feeling this straight though i hope it comes <laughs> i hope it comes out correct i'm trying to think if there's anything else that i want to say i hope that this video is not super long i just wanted to come on here real quick and kind of do a little review because i haven't done a review on this hair at all and a lot of people have been asking me on my social media what hair this is i just wanted to come and leave you know a small little review or whatever or whatever and you know talk to y'all a little bit i think that i enjoy like doing talking videos rather than the voiceovers Y'all, I have not eaten all freaking day. Our photo shoot is not even until freaking 4 o'clock. I'm really tripping for real, for real, because I'm I'm supposed to be using a heat protectant, but of course I ran out. I ran out. <laughs> Y'all, I ran out of all my freaking products. Like, I'm running out of them, and I cannot find them anywhere in this freaking country. I need to go to Stockholm. I'm like four hours away from Stockholm maybe five the city that i live in is called yet the body and it's the second largest city so that's why i'm confused as to why like stockholm is first and then we next so i'm confused as to why we wouldn't have the things that we need but yeah i normally would use a tresemme my tr i forget the name of it exactly but it's a black bottle with a red cap and it's just a tresemme heat protectant and it smells freaking amazing and it has my hair like super duper duper silky i believe that we all you know sleek and chic i don't know what the back looks like i'm not really gonna turn around and see because i know it looks a mess but i hope i can find a part y'all because i really want y'all to see it it's so trash if that's how you want to wear your part boo you know you know kudos to you you know what i'm saying but nobody should be wearing their part like that it's just not natural. If you wear wigs f just to have them on and not for them to look like they growing out your scalp, go for it. We know it's a wig. We know we don't have the screen door as a scalp, okay? Everybody knows that. Everybody knows, you know, about the wig movement. Make it look some type of natural. I don't know why I keep attempting to do these baby hairs. Like, I'm really good at it because I'm not. I'm, like, volunteering myself to do it, too. Like, come on, Corey, let's do some baby hairs. you know what so the very 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 last thing that i'm gonna do is take some of my foundation powder and just add it along my part so we can kind of define that part a little bit more yeah freckalicious def freckalicious definition make the boys go loco oh am i giving all leah vibes right there i'm definitely feeling a leah vibey one last thing i promise it's the very last thing i'm just using um my little wax stick and I'm going to just, just keep them flyaways from moving. I don't like to use too much. And I'm going to take my brush and brush them on down, baby. Var, she blows. <laughs> Who is she? <laughs> Who is she? <laughs> Who? Stop. Stop it. No. Hi, my name is Courtney. <laughs> Ooh, huh? <laughs> uh oh, movement. Body. Hello. <laughs> mm. Mm. Ooh. Yes. Here. <laughs> ah. <laughs> that is it for this video. I am done. I'm complete. I am a treat that is all for this video guys i hope that you enjoyed it make sure you give it a big thumbs up if you like these type of videos all of the details on this hair will be in the description box below and i gotta go i'm about to go eat so i don't pass out and then i gotta head out the door but i love you guys so 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 much and i can't wait to see you on the next one now give me a kiss mm -hmm.